nonprofit organization made of uh, volunteers who have wants to help modify <coughs> and revitalize our downtown. I am also have the honor of serving as the chairperson for the 125th birthday committee. At this time, I'd like to introduce our mayor, Thomas M. McDermott Jr. I'm going to go ahead and read the proclamation. Proclamation by the Honorable Thomas M. McDermott Jr., Mayor, City of Hammond, Indiana. Whereas in 1851, the first permanent settlers, Ernst and Caroline Holman, built, some home, uh, built a home and inn on the north bank of the Grand Cayman River near Holman Avenue, after which a small community named Holmanville sprang up. And whereas in 1869, George Hammond built a slaughterhouse and a meatpacking plant between the Cayman River and the Michigan Central Railroad. The plant became the largest of its type in the world at that time. And whereas Hammond's plant brought workers to the area, Marcus M. Toll, George Hammond's business partner, felt a permanent town was necessary to properly serve the influx of laborers. And whereas in the 1870s, Marcus Toll established the first subdivision of what would become Hammond, Indiana, and named his permanent settlement and post office in honor of George Hammond. And whereas Hammond was incorporated as a town December 4th, 1883, and whereas an election was held on April 21st, 1884, for the purpose of determining whether the town of Hammond should be incorporated as a city. The vote was in favor of Hammond and beco becoming a city, with Marcus M. Toll being elected to the city of Hammond's first mayor. And whereas 125 years had passed for Hammond as a city, and Hammond continues to rebuild and improve itself as a modern city while preserving its historical past. And whereas the citizens and the mayor of Hammond, Indiana, wish to recognize and celebrate the 125 year history of the city of Hammond. Therefore, I, Thomas M. McDermott, Jr., the 19th mayor of the city of Hammond, do hereby proclaim April 21st, 2009 as Hammond, Indiana's 125th anniversary day and call upon the people and the residents of Hammond to join their fellow citizens in recognizing and participating in this special observance. Sincerely, Mayor Thomas M. McDermott, Jr., Mayor of the City of Hammond. Thank you all very much. I want to recognize uh, Michelle Golden and the Golden Studios for doing this and observance of today's event. Okay. Thank you very much, Michelle. Okay, now uh, Mayor Thomas McDermott is going to make the first official contribution to our time capsule that we will put things in throughout the year. I, uh, I put in a copy of this year's State of the City address. I thought that was most appropriate for the time capsule. I put a little letter on the outside. I didn't think it was going to be for publication, but I'm going to read it off. Hopefully it was uh, to the future generations of Hammond residents who read this State of the City address from 2009. I hope you work as hard as we did in 2009 to keep this great city of ours prosperous and family friendly. In 2009, we faced many challenges in maintaining the quality of life for our residents. However, as Hammond's mayor, I have circled myself with excellent staff who all care as much as I do about this great city. I hope by the time you read this message that the jobs we are doing have paid off for the betterment of Hammond, Indiana. Best wishes to Hammond's future generation, Mayor Thomas McDermott Jr. So. Okay, now we're comments. The mayor uh, stated that we don't know what the future holds. And as a resident and business owner in Hammond, I encourage all of you to volunteer your time. Uh, join a committee, join an organization that can help make the city of Hammond a better place. There are really a lot of great opportunities out there, and if you don't know who you should uh, volunteer with, just ask me and Raimundo, and we'll be happy to point you in the right direction for volunteer opportunities. Um, we encourage you to help make Hammond a much better place, and together we can do that. So please do volunteer so that at the next uh, big anniversary, we'll have some really wonderful things to say about what we've accomplished. There's t-shirts for sale that are only $10 to commemorate our 125th birthdays, and they will be available throughout the year at different events, so we hope you'll take advantage and purchase one. So thank you everyone for coming. I hope that you will help uh, stimulate the economy and go out and celebrate Hammond's birthday today. Maybe visit a local restaurant, like El Taco Leo, <laughs> or Jim and Tammy from Freddy's Steakhouse in the back. I'm sure they'd love to see you there tonight. But thank you all for coming, and happy birthday, Hammond. And